this is uh, the centennial of, the, of World War I. And because of that, we decided to do an exhibition that, not, that placed the town of Greenwich inside that larger context of World War I. It, it took a long time for the U.S. to decide to enter, even with the sinking of the Lusitania, um, that actually uh, some lives were lost that were tied to Greenwich. Um, it, that did not get the U.S. to, to enter into the war. And, and Greenwich did have a unit that, that, that went over, and that's what this map is about, is to show some of the uh, places where they, where they fought. And this is um, J. Alton Talkman. He was uh, one of the um, soldiers that fought. And he actually, uh, his horse, Hannah, was going to go over with him, but he, they somehow got separated when they were over there, and he did not know where she was. And it was after the war was over, and he was on his way back to get on board the ship to return home when he saw her in line. And because she was with a unit, there's a whole, oh, she has a whole record. Of what we also have this wonderful diary. This one is by, uh, was written by Elsie Rockefeller, who lived here um, in a, a mansion on uh, Lake Avenue called Tea to Come. And so she says, all the war news, worse and worse. Mr. Scherson says the Germans could not keep up the, the expenses of their enormous army, could not disband. Nothing left but to fight. German emperor probably thinks he is more powerful than he is. Everyone is against him. All of these people are from, are from Greenwich, are related directly to Greenwich.